Cutters! Today we're doing a comparison video between the Taneco A10 Hero and the Dyson V8 Animal. We were sent the Dyson V8 Animal by the folks that make Taneco uh, because they wanted a review of their vacuum but also a comparison video between the two vacuums. So what I did was a review of the Taneco, a review of the Dyson, and now finally the comparison video between the two. So without further ado, let's get started. Here's the Taneco and the Dyson side by side. Trying to, trying to get an idea of the length, the difference. I think it's about the same. Yeah, about 40 inches on the Dyson. Oh no, it's a lot shorter on that one. It's 38 inches on the Taneco. So this one is definitely long, um, two inches longer. If you're a taller person, you might appreciate the Dyson more. All right, so here are the two vacuums. I think the boxes are about the same size. Yes. big differences between the Taneco and the Dyson is that the Taneco has a little lever here so that when you engage the trigger, you can put the lever back and use it trigger finger free, if you will. Whereas the Dyson doesn't have that lever, so in order to use it, you have to keep it engaged the entire time you're using it. between the Taneco A10 Hero and the Dyson V8 Animal. I'll include a link to both of them in the about section below, as well as a link to our individual review videos of each vacuum in case you want to get more into it. I hope you found it helpful if you're deciding between the two of them, and if you own one of them, let me know what you like about them in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now!